Here are the difference between brake pads and shoe. So, let's get started. Number 1. Front or back. Despite the numerous advantages of braking shoes, drum brakes require rear or four-wheel drive. These kinds of brakes can't be utilized in the front of the car, so if you have a front-wheel drive vehicle with brakes that need to be applied to the front, you'll require brake pads instead of shoes. Furthermore, you cannot use the two together, so if your car has drum brakes, you cannot use brake pads on them, and disc brakes cannot be used with brake shoes. As a result, knowing what your automobile is capable of and what kind of drive it has is an important element of picking between these two types of brakes. Number 2. Efficiency. The brake shoe is made of a durable material that can withstand a lot of friction. You can also tell when the shoe is getting worn since it has a weaker stop and requires more pedal contact. This makes it more trustworthy than the pad, which has a clear warning. While replacing the pad is easier and may be done on one's own, the shoe needs to be replaced less frequently. Number 3. Friction. The best reason to use a brake shoe is that it is comprised of a substance that gives the drum friction. There is some friction on the pad, but not nearly as much as in the shoe. This means that when you require a strong brake, the shoe will have the strongest traction and force, while the pad will be slowest to stop. Because the brake pad applies pressure to the disc to shove it into the automobile, there is less friction with the pad than with the shoe. Number 4. Position. The fundamental distinction between the two types of brake pads and shoes is where they are installed in the vehicle. Brake shoes were tailored to accommodate within drum-style brakes, whereas disc brake shoes are placed on top of the discs and serve to pressurize them when the brakes are applied. Most modern cars include a brake shoe, or a combined brake shoe, in their emergency system, which is generally thought to be safer than pads since it produces a more consistent stop. While you can't chop and change brake pads and shoes on the very same wheel, you may have all on the same car by using brake pads with drum brakes and brake shoes with disc brakes.